Go again, guys. Doing. Hello. How are you doing? Good. So, did you did you finish the story? Guys. Sorry, guys. Guys, did you finish to read the story? Yes. Did you find the event we have? Yes. How many you got? Nine. Nine. I told you that you to write at least how many? Mr. I in nine. Yes, good, excellent. I do ten. Yes. Mark. Are you ready, guys? Three more minutes. Yes. And wait for the rest. Okay, so let's start then. Please, your camera. Right now, we're going to start the story. First of all, I need you to tell me what happened in the story. What is the story about? <laughs> I talking to you guys. What happened in the story, guys? What happened in the story? What is the story about? Do they tell a biography or not? Yes. Yes. Uh, Who's the who's this who's this person that we that we talk or the story talks about? Which one? Listen, guys. If you do not participate, uh, it means uh, that you didn't. Did you read the story? Be honest. Be honest, please. Did you read the story? Did you finish? Or not? Yeah, me so, I'm asking something. Why do you uh, you don't participate? Mi oh. Mister, it, uh, it tells of Thomas Fortin. It's about Thomas Fortin, right? As you need to participate, I'm going to ask. I'm, African. Right? I'm going to ask individually. In this way, I will know if you read the story or not. So, it was, the story was about Thomas. Or who? Yes, of Thomas Fortin. He was an African American. Okay, so, which is the okay? What is which was the what this person did? Que hizo esta persona? How many occupations this person had? He defeated the the British. The British, and what else? In which job? Que trabajos tuvo esta persona? He, 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 he was a sailor. A sailor. A sailor. What else? And what else, guys? 
Taylor. And he works in a in a Mr. In a ship. In a, how do you say barco? In a ship. 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 Yes. He works in a ship. And could you please tell me uh, if he did something important for humanity or for human beings, for human rights, what this person did? Or, what, or why do you think we were reading this story? ¿Por qué creen que estábamos leyendo esta historia? Did, did, did he do something important? Yes. Yes. Okay. Did you mention what he did? What he did, right? ¿Qué importante hizo esta persona? Five hundred. Five. Five. About what? Seven. The person of American. For American, yes, of course. Yes, of course. That's why we are sharing this story. Uh, Kenneth and Gabriela, are you in the class? Because if you are not in the class, I will put you in the waiting room. Yes, you have to be with your camera on. It's an important role for this class. Yes. So now, I think that you finished your graphic organizing, right? About the event. Yes. So now, what? We are going to take the more important, right? And all together, let's create one. Yes? I don't know if you can see here. Can you see here? Yes. Yes. So, yes. what we're going to do here is that you will share with me which uh, event you have. And then I will write it here. Yes? But it doesn't, it doesn't mean that you have to, to do the same, but we are gonna do this together in order you to have a better idea about what we are gonna do tomorrow, yes? Because it is important you complete this graphic organizer to complete the task for tomorrow, yes? yes. So, which is the event number one that we have? Which is the, the beginning of the story? Or which do you consider is the first event that happened? James Ford was born in Philadelphia in 1766. Okay, he was born in Philadelphia. Like this? Um, yes, yes, yes. No, Mr. AP, AP. No, no, yes, yes, that way. In 1766. 1766. 17? 66. Six, sorry. 66. Yes? Yes. And what else? The number two. What do we have in number two? Was a sailmaker. He? But how? He was, he was concentrated in a, with a, in a sailor maker. He was? And what else? But he grew up during the American Revolution. Yes, Angele. Good job. Could you repeat again, Angele? He grew up during the American Revolution. He. Sorry. Sorry, guys. He grew up during. The American Revolution. The American Revolution. Good job, Angelo. Yeah? And then, what happened then? Because remember that this, the idea of doing this is like if you are, if we are writing on biography, a biography, right? And then what happened with this boy? What happened after he grew up? He was concentrated. He started working. He started working. Like a sailor maker. As a sailor maker. Sailor maker. Yes? 
So how many events we have? You see? How Three. many? Three. 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 And then what happened? After he started working there, what happened then in the story? What happened? He worked in a beach. He did so for two more he years worked. after which he took a job in a small school. Would you repeat again, Andrea? Because I couldn't hear you. He did so for two more years after which he took a job in a small store. He worked for two more years. For two years? And what? And then? He took a job in a small store. He took. A what? Would you repeat again? A job. A job. He took a job. Ah. Huh? In a small store. Yes. He took a job in a small store. Yes, you see. And then what do you have? An important one. He had seen Africans in James Beijing Marshall through the streets. Could you repeat again? He had seen Africans in James Beijing Marshall through the streets. Okay, and then he went to Africa, you said? He traveled to Africa or not? He had seen African. Aha, uh -huh. and then? Marshall crossed the streets. Okay, so listen, guys. Now, as we have just a one, two, three, four, five, yes, we have to write the ones that are really important, right? Let's start looking for the important action of this boy. Because remember that we are writing a biography, right? And these are the, the clouds we have. And then we're going to join all these events using the adverbs, right? That we use in, in a sequence, right? Like first and then after. Yes, do you understand what we are doing? Yes or not? Entienden que lo que estamos haciendo, guys? Yes. Okay, so yes. Let, I'm going to give you a three minutes to think in an important event or an important thing that this person did after he worked there. Yes? Después de que él eh, trabajó aquí, después an important event that happened with him or an important thing that he did. Let's take a look at it. Let's remember what happened in this story. Yes? When you're ready, you, you have to tell me. Think about it. Two minutes. I'm going to give you two minutes. Oh, do you have something? Do you have something, guys? Yes or not? Yes, yeah, mister, I have one. Okay, tell me, Angel. What the result of this sensitive friendship with the Captain Basley? Okay, I, I, I don't understand what you are trying to say. Can you please tell me slowly and with a better idea or some or something more clear. Peter. This Thomas were fourteen was working or a cheat when he feels. Aha, uh -huh. then he start working in a ship, you said? Yes. Okay, then he start working. 
he start working in a shed. Sir, I have other. Okay, let, let's let the other person participate. Okay. Yes? And after he working uh, for a ship, what happened, Andrea Montserrat? What happened with, with him? Monse? What happened with him? Or what, we, or what do you have in that? What do you have in your sequence events? Um... Wait, I have my 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 notebook. Um, I'm gonna pick up my notebook and I'm gonna say you what I have. Okay, hurry up, hurry up. And let's see then, Maria, what do you have in your sequence event? After he worked for a ship, what he did? What important thing he did? After he worked on a ship. Yes. Después de que él trabajó en el barco, ¿qué hizo? Gustavo, do you have an idea? After he worked for a ship. Brisa, Miguel Ávila. In the summer of 1781, James Fulton signed on to the Trivet Royal. Okay, in summer. In 1781, James Fulton signed on to the Privilege Royal. He what? I, I don't understand. He what? He signed on to the Privilege Royal. Sign? Sign? Yes. What? What he signed? A document? Mm. A document? Mm. About what? ¿Qué firmó él, Miguel? The problem is that I'm listening a, a lot of noise. That's why uh, it is impossible to understand. So to turn up your microphone to everyone, then listen to Miguel Avila. Yes? Yes, Miguel? Until the private royal rules. Uh huh. Until? The private royal rules. Until the royal what? You say? The private royal rules. Rules. What that? Would you please spell that word? L O I S. L O I S. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So, how many are missing? And you haven't told me, you haven't told me, you haven't told me what he did. Then he fouled or what happened? He went to the he war. Wa he, wa he wants to save the uh, Americans. He saved Americans? He saved I said he wants. Okay, guys. I think that I helped to you. Now you have to finish. I think that I'm missing three or more. If you have 10, it is okay. Yes, but you have to complete this chart. I have nine. 
Okay, excellent. If you got nine, excellent. Mister, I have okay. twelve. Wow. This is an example about what we're going to do. Yeah? Then, let's suppose that we have to do an event. I am the microphone because it is making interference in our meeting. Then, let's suppose that we have here, yes, all the events, right? So, after you have the, this chart, what you are going to do is to join all of this, yes? Like, for example, James, let's write, James Ford, then, yes? Which is the first event we have? Yes, was born. Yes, good job. Was born in. Mister, I have other one. The last. Mister, I have one hidden. Mister, I have one. The first. The... I know that you have a lot of things, a lot of events, right? And. Eso ustedes lo van a dejar para su sequence, ¿verdad? Eso lo van a dejar para ustedes, ¿verdad? Para su trabajo. This is an example about what we are doing, yes? And then, to write the biography, we have to use the adverbs, right, that we use for the events. Yes? Could you please mention which are those ad adverbs? Which are first? First. Okay, and then we're gonna use first. First, comma, no. Then, we're gonna use then. Then, he grew up during American Revolution. Yes? Now here we have the adverbs. Here we have the adverbs. And then what happened? After that, after he what happened then? He started working as a sailor maker, right? Or not? Yes. But he, uh, he was employed by Mr. Robert Bridge. That in the notebook. Yes. Yes. So, and this is all that you have to do, guys. Yes, we have to use, but the only difference that you have to use Right, that frequency, right? And how to copy this in the notebook? Yes, but with your work. Ustedes tienen ahí, ¿verdad? Este solo es un ejemplo. Yes? Now, are you clear about what we are going to do? Yes. That is forward, or we need to do that right now? It is forward. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. And tomorrow, I'm going to send you instruction about what we're going to do tomorrow. And what you have, uh, what you have ready. Que es lo que tienen que tener listo, right? Okay. So, we will stop here. Yeah, we will stop here. And please, if you haven't finished your frequency, you will not finish. Tomorrow assignment, guys, has a value. Tienen valor acumulativo, so we have to work. And if, you have, if we have to work, we have to must be ready with your sequence, right, of the event. Yeah? I'm going to send you instruction about what you have to be ready. Or have to have ready. Yes? Yes, guys, do you have questions? No. No? no. So we will stop here then.